Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I hope everybody's having a great week and a great going to be having a great weekend for you guys. The day that I'm recording this day, I'm going to be uploading it day of. So, I've been weighing my options. It has been a good minute since I last played Pokemon Crystal League, and you guys have been continuing to show the support. And I have been racking my brain around this option of resetting, and I decided to just go ahead and do so. I, I kind of. Uh, sat back and thought about the thought process of uh, how I was doing in the previous run through with a fire deck. I kind of deleted certain car or sold certain cards that I felt like I should have kept, leveling certain Pokemon and not or not uh, or leveling certain Pokemon when I should have leveled up certain other Pokemon. There's a lot of uh, nuances that I wish I've done this, that, and the other, but. And then I think this is our probably our one of our better moves is just to start fresh, new. We can start saving up our money, being better about buying glyphs, leveling up sooner than later. Because in the uh, previous time, I did not level up until a little bit later on. But we went with the fire deck. I was thinking about the water deck, which sounded pretty cool with Blast, probably Squirtle, and Toad are going to be your. Uh, to water Pokemon, but I think I'm leaning towards the grass one. Probably again, Bulbasaur and Chikorita are probably, yep, our two Pokemon. And then, of course, we get Spearow and Pidgey as Spearow, Pidgey, and Rattata as our other three Pokemon. And so, okay, so we can go against the Professor. It's going to reward us of the money, but we've already went against, we've already played this before. So we have the option of a free cart or a card pack. That's another thing I wish I would have done is earlier on went and did this uh, white bud town to uh, go and buy packs, get certain Pokemon, have the opportunity to get certain Pokemon. So we got Jinx, Sneasel, and Ditto, which I think these two are going to be really good with the Psychic Ice and Dark Ice are going to be really good. Ditto is an interesting Pokemon, but... Let's go ahead and we'll add, of course, we're going to add uh, Pidgey, we'll add Rattata, we'll add Sneasel and Chikorita, um, we'll add Jinx, we're going to add, we got to go and get some Berry Packs so we can get Jinx, so we're going to have to actually remove uh, Jinx, we got up to four of the uh, Orin berries. We do have one Lepa berry, so we just gotta save up some of our. Uh, that's the most we got as up to five, but we only need four right now. We could add a Spiro or a Ditto, um, but for now we'll just keep five. And then looking to probably either level up, which again we need to level up as much as possible. Also get uh, glyphs. As much as possible. Let's go ahead and level up, and we'll go ahead and level up. Bubbles are our primary Pokemon. One, one, and one. That's also another thing I want to look. Make sure that we're paying attention to is looking at the statistics of one, one, and one. So Chikorita, a lot of these Pokemon other than Pidgey, I we could easily level up and get some good statistics from it. Let's go ahead and level up Bulbasaur. We'll go and eventually level up. Uh, so it's ninety dollars to one hundred and ten. Let's go ahead. Okay, so oh, we need a minimum of six cards. That is a okay. Let's add in Spiro. There is our five limit. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, that is perfectly fine. Let's go get right into the battle. Go and level up every single Pokemon if we have the opportunity, and go from there. One, two, three. We'll go add a Pokemon. One and one. Statistically, I'm able to hit the Ekans, beat the Ekans, so we'll go ahead and do, do such. Uh, oh, that's right. We cannot attack on the first turn. Never mind. So this could be a tad bit of an issue. Um, one in one. So we should be able to knock out the Ekans on the next turn. We'll end turn. We might lose this battle. Yeah, we lose this battle because we don't have another berry. Terrific start. I always love seeing uh, a great start like this. 
That's a okay. We just gotta be better about getting our berries next time. We have a hundred dollars for a berry pack. Let's go ahead and get a berry pack. Do we, we do get the lung berry? That's huge. Oh, let's go ahead and add Jinx. Oh, we just need we only need one leopard berry. We need one lung berry. We should be good. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Let's go against the Roughneck because we don't have any money whatsoever. We'll, we're going to develop our group as a core, the core as a good group and go from there. Chikorita versus Weedle. Weedle's going to do more damage to us. So we'll put Chikorita right there. Can I attack on our first turn, which is A-OK. -okay. Weedle. We can knock out that Weedle. We can knock out the other Weedle too. Boom. We are just having the worst luck when it comes to this. Uh... Okay. Go get some berries, attack. And Ekans. Okay. Not looking good. We gotta try to possibly get a Pokemon that has get does an orange berry. Oh well, we're gonna lose again because if we knock out the Nidoran, we lose. Yeah, we we get outright lost. Because even if I were to do one damage, that brings us a two. So either way, we're gonna lose. Ouch. That really sucked. They already had three glyphs on one Pokemon. Okay. Terrific start. Uh, let's go get a Pokemon. We're going to end turn. Hopefully, we can get ourselves a Pokemon that can help. Uh, this is off to a pretty rough start. Pretty rough start. Go get some more berries here in a second. Unfortunately, we're not able to do anything with that. Rattata versus Rattata. I think would be the move to stop the bleeding. Or we can just outright lose. Okay. <laughs> um, we can battle the last. Three. So we get some more berries. That's, I think, the optimal play. They can get out another Pokemon, but for us to have as many options when it comes to the berries, I think is a better move. Um, as you can tell, the, like I was telling you guys in that, uh, in the uh, House Flipper videos, that I've been having a lot of mouse issues, and I don't know why. Okay. Go ahead and put Rattata over here just to chip away a little bit of damage. Spiro. Let's go ahead and put Spiro over here. I didn't mean to do that. Like I said, I tried. I, I don't know what's why that's doing that for, but that's a terrific start. Let's go get some more berries, chip away some health. We don't have any more berries, so there's going to be one Pokemon that is just not going to do anything, unfortunately. There we go. They already have like 30 different types of berries, that's crazy. More than one. So let's go and put that over there. Boom, boom. We're so close. Bulbazar. There we go. Okay. We might actually get our first dub. And not quite there yet. And there's our first win. Oh my word. We finally got it, guys. Whew. 
We can't afford to go and get a level up, unfortunately. We're seven dollars shy of that, but that's okay. I'm gonna go and pretty much get five berries in turn. We'll take one damage, that's okay. A glyph transforms into opposing enemy Pokemon. Okay. Question marks because it being it being a ditto where it transforms. I'm gonna put Jinx right there. Just trip away one point of damage. Great start. One in one question mark. Normal flying. Let's go ahead and put Spiro there. In turn. One, one, and one. Let's go ahead and put Chikorita over here. Maybe. And in turn. Let's go get some more berries. In turn. Okay. One and one, one and one. Um, probably the ghastly would be the move. Whooper. So we lose outright on this one, also, because we got another Pokemon. Raises the attack of nearby family by two. So we we, we lose again. But like what uh, Alexander had mentioned in. The, like one of the first videos first or the second video he mentioned that glyphs are pretty broken I mean that's that's ridiculous that courage uh, glyph we just gotta be patient so I can't do either of the out two uh, two ones on the outer side so we got his Gogan's the maniac hopefully we can get some glyphs and rework our team and start from fresh Sneasel, so one and one, one and one. So let's put Sneasel right there. Perfect. Very aggressive people in this one. Um, let's get rid of the Swinub. Swinub. Go from there. One and one, so again, just get rid of more Pokemon. Let's go get some more berries. In turn. Let's go put Spiro right here. We'll chip away four damage to the, his health. And we got the win. Awesome. Tribute to $180. Go and do the payout. So now we can level up, which I think is the move. Let's level up Sneasel. Let's do some battling. And hopefully we can go and get a car. Uh, we can get a win here so that we can possibly get a glyph, would be nice. Whooper and Magikarp. Okay. Well, we can't do anything there. Rotata. Knock out that one Pokemon. We'll go probably get some more berries. So we got all of our berries. Let's go throw. Sneasel over here. Not got that one whooper. Another Spiro. Do you mean to click on that? But there we go. Perfect. Try to chip away his health again. Maybe. There we go. Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur over here. One, two, 
three, four, and actually, yeah, five. Actually, with the bulbs are excellent news. So, I'm gonna do something, and we could win against him. We probably would have won, but I think this is the move. We could level up. We're gonna level up some Pokemon. Make certain that we're we're staying at a good pace. Card pack or free card. Let's level up, because leveling up, well, I kind of want to save up to get a glyph, because glyphs are pretty broken. Okay. Ghastly, Tyrogue, and Caterpie. Let's go with Ghastly. Get another... Oh, man. Level up. Payout. Let's get a payout so that way we can get a glyph, possibly. Ruthless. Opposing cards to defense is lowered by two. That's pretty sick. The question is, is who's going to be our support glyph person? I do like the idea of Sneasel being our support, but yet Bulbasaur is pretty good too. Let's go with Sneasel. Cannot afford to bubble up, so we'll go into the Roughneck. I'm already feeling, I feel a lot better uh, playing, restarting fresh that we can go and we should be in a good predicament as far as this. Um, so we need a Actually, we do need to go get another green. I just realized that. Because he wasn't just one leopard berry, but with him being a glyph, you have to have an additional an additional berry. That's right. Which is A-OK. -okay. Maybe. There we go. Chip away some more health. We'll go get another Pokemon, or go get some more berries. Not that concerned about the Kakunas. Not overly concerned about it. Okay. So one and one. Let's go ahead and do that. Chip away some more of his health. Let's go get another Pokemon. Level two. Let's put Pidgey over here and but we didn't really have to even do all that extra steps. We ended up getting the dub. $106, I'll take that. Level up, a card pack, or battle. Can't do the card pack. We could level up. Let's level up. Let's level up. Ghastly. One, one, and one. Yeah, that's, that's definitely the play. Let's go against the bug catcher. Three, four, five. I, th I think with how aggressive they are when it comes to only having one berry or one uh, extra card, I think this is the, one of the uh, better moves. So we're going to do two. He's going to do one. Technically, because his actually his defense is actually lowered by two. Go and get some more berries. Chip away some more health. Ghastly. Two and zero. So either one I can be able to finish off. There we go. Pick up Ghastly. We can go and finish off the Catcher P. And that is GG. Awesome. Yeah, leveling up extremely early, like what Alexander has also mentioned, I think was the play. Can't afford either the glyph nor the card pack. The opponent's attack is lowered by one. So the the uh, di, uh, debil, debil, deb, debilitate debilitate uh, with that and the uh, ruthlessness uh, glyph would be sick. Uh, 
combo because you're lowering the attack and the defense I think would be a really sick uh, extremely aggressive like what I've talked about before just now To stop the bleeding of our health, I think this would be our better move. We're actually we lost. Wow, they went super duper aggressive. Wow. Um, I might just sit here for a good minute and just play and level up Pokemon, get glyphs, and so that way later on. We are in a good position. Uh, would be the I think is the move. Just do this couple, uh, probably one or two more times, and then go from there. Unfortunately, we do not have Lumberry. I keep forgetting I grabbed that extra Lumberry. Um, we lost already. Wow. Now let's go against this. Okay. A reminder to just go ahead and pick up that extra berry. Um, two and two. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of that idea. Let's go ahead and throw him over here. That's not the most ideal position. One and one, one and two. So let's throw Pidgey over here. Chip away some health. One. Let's go ahead and knock that out. Um, let's throw Pit Spear right here. Chip away one extra health point. Okay, so let's go get some more berries, and then in turn. Chinx, two, two and one. But we can't even do that anyways, for the fact that we don't have that last uh, on berry. Three, one, and two. Well, I don't think it matters anyways, because if I don't put them in front of this, I'm doing three, they're going to do three damage. Or four damage there. Um, and you block and do two damage, you're not going to do any damage there. Let's go ahead and put Ghastly here. Finish that off. Bulbazar does shut cut pop on down let's put him over here with the Nidoran <coughs> okay he's not gonna do anything to either one of these Pokemon because that's level 2 Pichu which is level 1 to Rattata but for the blocking sake, uh, for, just for the simple block, um, let's go ahead and get the last Pokemon of ours in turn. So we lost this battle. Because I'm not doing any damage with either one of these. Well, one damage, but um, yeah, it, that's a GG. I can't, I could throw him over here but we're gonna do four to their five so long term this is not gonna be I'm not gonna be able to do anything in this circumstance yep okay so again we need to go and let's do a buyout okay eighty dollars again and then a we should be able to afford the glyph on the next one, so let's go ahead and do another buyout. Let's go add another. Oh, so we don't have another Lumberry. So we can get rid of the Jinx for now. Well, we could go get a berry pack. Let's go get a berry pack. 
We do get the. Oh, we got two Merlon berries. That's great news. <clears throat> so, one, two Merlon berries. One, two Leopard berries. And I should have one, two, three, four, five of the Orange berries. Good. So now we go against a hiker. And this will probably be the last one. I do feel like we're in a better position. I I know I've repeated that like five different times, but I I know I uh, have not uploaded it. I've been wrapping my head around this thought process on if I want to restart for you guys or do I want to try to push through. But I think it's more convenient for uh for both of us the view for you viewers the community that i would reset is a lot more fun i know how to uh for certain circumstances that this would be easier for us to actually push through the the game than to sit there and repeatedly do the same thing over and over and over again so um let's knock out that sw swine nub Beautiful. Okay. Three damage. Ah, so we can't even get the gas leak out. And that is GG. Victor right there. Awesome. And we might actually be able to do another one. Okay. Evolution 500. Let's go ahead and Hop right into a battle. Oh, I just actually get gang, uh, gas into a Gengar. It'd be sick. Two, three, four, five. He's very aggressive, I can tell already. Two to his one. There we go. Okay. Jinx. Two to one to this two. Zero damage to the magic card because it's level two. So let's put Jinx right next to Bulbazar. Chip away some health. We lost anyways, so. Extremely aggressive. Like, I'm trying to. With him and him be able to. Uh, uh, for him to be able to go and do what he did, that was. Uh, he was extremely aggressive. He went first. He was able to get his Pokemon out and then uh, get an attack on the following turn. He was very aggressive. Um, I'd like to go actually get more packs, but I want to save our money for another glyph. Again, very aggressive. One, two, three. Let's get, try and see if we can get a Pokemon. We can't even get him out anyways, so. Now we got either one of them, so we lost. Wow. Okay. Um, let's go with a free card and see if we can get something that's not bad. Weedle is the move. I want to say Weedle is the move. We can add him. We're up to nine Pokemon now. Glyph, Lucky, grants 2 DP when played. Hmm. I like that idea of Lucky de de debilita debilitate and ruthless together. That'd be pretty sick combos. Let's go with that, and we'll go put it on Sneasel. Awesome. Debilitate. <clears throat> okay. One more battle, and then we'll call it for this video. And in the next video, we'll go and uh, go get five berries. So they get attacked first? No. Okay. Good, good, good. Three damage outright. Okay. Boom. S 
Spiro to zero to two. So let's we'll put Spiro over here to provide some more health. Rattata. One, two, three, four. Because he's in a position of. Let's put Rattata over here. Block the incoming damage. Okay. Okay. Caterpie. He has a glyph on him. I need to level up Chikorita. I think that's also our move, is that we gotta level up Chikorita. Okay. One, two, three, four. You get Weedle. Uh, let's put Weedle here, not gonna do any damage. Okay. Let's go get some more berries. Okay. Yeah, we lost. Huh. Throw Pidgey over here. Yeah, that's four damage right there. Wow. Kind of, they kind of played very passive. And I played quite aggressive in that circumstance. We'll go get some more money. And I think that is going to do it here, guys. Thank you all for sticking around as long as you guys have. You guys continuously are watching uh, the previous Pokemon Crystal League videos, and I appreciate it. We will, can, I'll probably, uh, we'll probably in the next video finish off this run. I'll probably finish off this run and then start me another one. I'm, I'm gonna try to process this uh, off off camera as I was, as I'm uploading this onto YouTube. We'll uh, I'll have a thought process on if I want to finish off this run and then start another one and then get to where we're back to the trainer or the gym leader. So that way it's not just me just constantly repeating this uh, right here. But thank you all for watching. And with all that being said, guys, I'll talk to you guys later.